Hey guys and gals, sweet project cars here. Comparison of bolt release agent. We have this one here called Spin Off, battling against, as you know, the number one most popular since 1957 release agent, Blaster, PB Blaster. Let's first get physical and do some destruction. I am going to take and mar these threads up. I painted them both black so you could see that they're exactly the same. I actually labeled them S for spin-off and B for blaster. Now this video will be unedited. From this point on you're going to see it in real time exactly a comparison between these two products. We'll see what happens here. Unedited from this point forward. We're going to mar it up with a rubber hammer. I'm just kidding you. We're going to take our sweet 25.5.68 pound ball peen hammer. Nah, it's about four pounds. It's a good sized one. And we're going to bash these threads as much as we possibly can and do it evenly. So here we go. Now we've got that one beat up pretty good. We're going to do it a few more times here. Now we'll take this one. Now I don't know which one's which. But I'm just beating it up. And you know what it's like when you get marred up threads like this. I'll take my glove off. As I said, this is unedited from this point out. This is the PB Blaster bolt. Good marred up threads. Doesn't look like it would do real well getting a nut off of it. And this one we actually, looks like we beat on it a little bit more. And this is our spin off. Let's get cranking and see what happens at this point. I'm going to move the camera back. As I said, we're doing it unedited. How many times do I have to say that, eh? And I'm doing it that way so that you can see there's no tomfoolery going on here. No, no trickery. This is the B. And I want you to do this, you get a chance to check it out. I can already tell you what my sweet level is going to be on this because I've already done this process a couple of times and uh, you'll see that here. We'll take our PB Blaster, spray it down. And I'm going to wear gloves because I don't need to be slipping off there. Now this video will be a little bit longer because, like I said, I'm not going to edit it out or speed it up or do any of that stuff. And you've seen the threads on this. They're pretty marred up. i got to get up there to them. Okay, it's taking quite a bit of force. Two hands on that. And then we'll take a look at the threads when we get done. So if you've got a bolt that's rusted up, marred up, and you can't get the nut off of it or get it apart, you would use your PB Blaster usually. But we're going to show you a product that is I 
think, going to take the world by storm. <clears throat> I'm trying to do it as fast as I can because there's nothing more boring than watching somebody do a process you've already seen them do for 10, 15 seconds. That's why we speed a lot of our stuff up. Now it's getting a little bit easier at the top because the threads weren't smashed at the top. All right, that seemed pretty normal for PB Blaster. And again, I'll pull this out here, show it to you. Doing a lot of grunting and groaning here. There's the B. Now for the spin off. Shake the can up good. And what I like to do on any bolt that I ever do, let it soak for a minute or two. It's not going to hurt a thing. Okay, we're getting up to the mash threads. You can see it right there. Let me zoom in here a little bit. See those mashed threads right there. We've done even worse bolts than this, and it's, uh, I gotta tell you, pretty amazing. One handed, it's like pure magic. Let's do it with two, two fingers. Let's zoom back out a little bit here. See, I would edit that out, but I'm not going to. Let's do it with two fingers. You see the threads, how bad they are. Two fingers. And them threads are mashed at the top there as well. We actually hit the bolt on the back side. Two fingers. I would say there is a... So let's take a look at the threads up close. Okay, there's our B. Luckily, uh, that stayed on there because we wouldn't know which one was which. That's our PB blaster on this side, and the other one washed off from the removement, from the removant, yeah, from the removement of the serendipitous. Now you know why we have editing. I'm giving this nine and three quarters sweets. It is now going to be, because we've done other testing on it, spin off is now our new release agent and lubricant for everything we do from here on out. And I'm testing you and challenging you to try the same thing and tell me what you think. Get back to me with your feedback. Do some rusted bolts. Do some stuff that's really bad. And I mean, looks like you gotta get a torch out. Try this stuff. It's going to blow your mind. All the information will be on their website. It's absolutely amazing what this stuff is.